Hi everyone, welcome to Nefis TV. Today I'm sharing with you a bite-sized version of pizza that will make everyone so happy. These little bites are perfect for parties, an easy pizza night, and even for breakfast. So here's how to make them. For the dough, place 200 ml of warm milk, 120 ml of warm water, 100 ml of oil, 2 teaspoons of sugar, and 10 grams of instant yeast in a large bowl. Mix together using a spoon. Add half of the flour and 1 teaspoon of salt. Then knead until the dough begins to form. Continue to knead bringing in the rest of the flour. Keep kneading until you have a smooth, springy, soft dough. Cover the dough with plastic wrap and then with a kitchen towel and let rise in a warm place until doubled in size, about 30 minutes. Meanwhile, prepare your desired toppings. I'll use sausages, pepperoni, green peppers and olives. If you want mushrooms, onions or any other topping, just go for it. And keep in mind that sometimes leftovers make great pizza toppings too. Remove the plastic cover, punch the dough down and turn it out onto a work surface. Knead for another minute so it deflates a bit. Then flatten it with your hands and roll it out into a rough circle. Try not to roll too thick as it will keep rising until you put it in the oven. With a round cutter or a glass, cut the dough into rounds. Lay the bases on baking sheet lined with parchment paper. You can slightly press on them. Just make them thinner than you think they should be, as they will shrink and puff up during baking. Do the same with the rest of the dough. These ingredients will make two trays of mini pizzas. For the sauce, I use the tomato sauce that I canned for the winter adding a little bit of thyme. Spoon on the tomato sauce and spread over the bases evenly using a brush. Then top with the shredded mozzarella cheese and place your desired toppings on the pizzas. Bake in the 180 degrees preheated oven about 20-25 minutes. Prepare the second tray the same way. If you want more cheesy pizzas toward the end of cooking time, you can sprinkle on a little more cheese and bake until cheese is melted. I haven't used extra cheese for the first tray. Either way, it is delicious. Super easy mini pizzas are ready to be served. This recipe will make 30 mini pizzas, but of course you can make bigger pizzas. You can freeze leftover pizza and enjoy later. You'll need to put them in a plastic bag and freeze. I would recommend adding a bit of extra fresh cheese on the top before popping them in the oven. Making mini homemade pizza quickly became one of our favorite meals to serve. Especially kids love it so much. I hope you give this delicious recipe a go and enjoy. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. We are sharing new videos every single week, so make sure you hit the notification bell as well. Also, leave me a comment down below to let me know what else you want to see me making in an upcoming video. Thanks for watching.